Was it the jinni again? And what did our friend want this time? To strip the flesh from my bones? Dine on my innards? Never has much to say, yet it leaves its mark. I can still feel it crawling on my skin. Hardly original. You should tell it as much. Forget the jinni for the moment. The day is new. There is work to be done. Durwish has left another contract. Who for? Them again? We would make more money selling water to a camel. <sighs> Come, Nihal. Where is your sense of duty? Duty does not fill our bellies. No, but it does enrich the soul. I will be outside. I told Nihal this would be impossible to sell when she stole it, but she could not resist. Wonder what it is about these ancient baubles that fascinates her so. Kick up some sand, Basim. The sun casts a long shadow. Let us not keep Durwish waiting. I cannot bear another lecture. These contracts. It is quite a few Darwish has pushed your way now. He knows I will come through. You have his trust. That much is clear. <laughs> Do you suppose you have the answer? These shadowy types? I should hope so by now. Then they should show it. You take all the risk and they offer little in return. They are liberators, Nihal, not merchants. I know the stories. Still, the price of liberty should be enough to feed us. About this contract, I do not want you to mistake my words for pestering. I am only looking out for you, Yasadiki. It is no inconvenience to stand up to our oppressors as the Hidden Ones do. Do you think yourself some hero of tomorrow, the next Gilgamesh? No. I am merely the son of a public servant who dedicated his life to the betterment of his people. Only to be slighted and forgotten. But, I am honored you think I could reach such heights. I may just aim for them. That is not at all what I said. It is what I heard. Such crowds. Something important must be happening. The Khalifa has been summoned to the Winter Palace. It is surely his wealthy retinue that drives this crowd. They're in the mood to offer donations. Ah, I see your meaning. A little sleight of hand to sharpen our wits. If this contract will not feed us, the Hilafa might as well. That merchant has left his purse on the table. An easy one to begin with. Better leave before they notice. Ready yourself. I will pick them out. A keen eye and an agile hand. A formidable duo. Hmm. 
Hmm. There. The boisterous one. He must have something of value. Sneaky, sneaky. And over there, by that stall, she's got some coin. Well done. You truly are the master thief of Anbar. Is that jealousy I hear? Hardly, O oh great leader of purses. Insufferable. Come, we are late to Durwishes. Good to see you. Greetings. They are all looking spry. I want. I mean, how much good has I am if we need them? Ha! They are Peace, all friend. looking spry. I wonder what tales we will hear today. Tall ones, most of them. <sighs> Someone has hold food. Go to Zaid. That shit. You look weird. It is nothing. What do they need? A ship. This you will buy. We and we will. Shocking. He is. And you are. Steal a sword or a helmet. Mutia, I do. Is he hot? You are on your own, Basim. I do. I you. was the final tally of what we received? Sixteen crates. One chest, half a dozen satchels. Only three crates remain, last time I checked the ledger. Give their handlers until tomorrow evening. If they don't show by then, we must assume they've forgotten about their wares. Shh. Open them up. Keep whatever catches our eyes. Dump the rest. Wait here. If I am seen, I will have to flee. Good thing I can outrun these sagging guards.
Let us not keep to the wish. I cannot bear another lecture. It takes but a few simple tools to build the greatest of mosques. I hope you continue to share your wisdom, Father, wherever you are. I told Nihal this would be impossible to sell when she stole it, but she could not resist. Wonder what it is about these ancient... that fascinates her so. Contracts. It is quite a few Darwish has pushed your way now. He knows I will come through. You have his trust. That much is clear. Do you suppose you have theirs? These shadowy types? I should hope so by now. Then they should show it. You take all the risk and they offer little in return. They are liberators, Nihal, not merchants. I know the stories. Still, the price of liberty should be enough to feed us. About this contract, I do not want you to mistake my words for pestering. I am only looking out for you, Yasadiki. It is no inconvenience. No, but it is... <laughs> Such crowds. Something important must be happening. The Khalifa has been summoned to the Winter Palace. It is surely his wealthy retinue that drives this crowd. Perhaps they're in the mood to offer donations. Ah, I see your meaning. A little sleight of hand to sharpen our wits. If this contract will not feed us, the Hilafa might as well. That merchant has left his purse on the table. An easy one to begin with. Better leave before they notice. Come here. Ready yourself. I will pick them out. A keen eye and an agile hand. A formidable duo. Mm. There. The boisterous one. He must have something of value. Sneaky, sneaky. 
And over there, by that stall, she's got some coin. Well done. You truly are the master thief of Anbar. Is that jealousy I hear? Hardly, O oh great leader of Persis. Insufferable. Pride. I wonder what tales we will hear today. <laughs> Tall ones, most certainly. Hello. Come here. Steal anything good today? 